uh, the year is almost over and since people like to make resolutions for the start of the new year I think it's a good time to start thinking about the people in your life that uh, cause you a lot of grief and um, my one of my recent videos was about understanding them why they are the way they are but that doesn't mean you have to be their their willing victim because then you're actually helping them to continue behaving like that because they have someone to uh, inflict their venom on even if they can't help it it's not something good for them every time they get excited you know with with anger or revenge or whatever it is they're making more adrenaline in your in their bodies this raises their blood pressure it can cause uh, extreme problems in, including you know strokes and heart attacks and uh, it can destroy uh, tiny blood vessels that uh, can cause all kinds of uh, issues so if you're the kind of person that doesn't think of yourself that thinks of others then think of them that when you are placing yourselves with them and they have somebody to verbally attack besides it being stressful for you you're helping them to help them to hurt themselves I don't know if I'm putting this in the right words don't be a willing victim love them yes yes from a distance you can love them from a distance you could send them letters and and um, and gifts you can hire someone to go help them if they need help it doesn't have to be you let's say you don't have money to hire someone well then you could trade something with someone you have a a relative that also lives near them well you could do something for them and then they in turn can pay you back by doing something for your your difficult relatives so um, loving from a distance is not less than loving them in person it's the same it you know think about when when you get uh, a letter or an email from someone you haven't heard from in a long time doesn't that feel good isn't it the same the same good emotion as if you saw them in person you know um, they say we're primates okay so apes they don't have speech they have to communicate physically they have to uh, hug each other and shake hands and all that we have speech we can send emails don't make a phone call to these people because then you'll have to listen to to all the uh, sarcasm and and the and the verbal abuse send a letter send an email send a gift send a bouquet of flowers whatever let them know that there's nothing wrong you can say things like um, well you know there's uh, life's getting very busy for me it's get complicated I don't want to explain it but I'm going to have to um, you know help you or uh, keep in touch with you from a distance you know keep it simple keep it polite don't give them the satisfaction that they're bothering you happiness success is the best revenge they say you don't need revenge but but you need to just let them know that that you're okay you know don't give them the satisfaction of of letting them know that it bothers you you're disappointed you're depressed you know you're yearning for them don't do that okay if there's anything I left out or if, if there's a better way of explaining what I'm trying to say then please let me know